level won't be overcome just through experience. You'll need luck as well. I see something special in you. Like the man who climbed this entire tower long ago. So somebody got out of here before. I'm gonna do even better than he did. There's more than one person depending on me now. This is the 13th question. Which is easier on you? To be loved or to love? <laughs> So that's your choice. All right, let's get going. You've come more than halfway up this level. After two more trials, it will end. You will then be at the cathedral. It doesn't matter where I am anymore. I'm gonna keep climbing until I've reached the goal. I'm gonna take care of everything tomorrow. After that, I'll finally be able to tell her how I feel. I'm gonna finish climbing this thing tomorrow and move on with my life. This is the final challenge, a 10-story wall. Use your mind to create a path to the entrance for the next area. I am not gonna die. Commencing area four. Are you ready? Just a little more. Edge. Oh, you got it. Edge. All right, I got it. I got it. Edge. All right, I got it. 
this far. I think I've misjudged you. She go to some young bastard. Just watch. I'll get her back. She will be mine. Are you the only one here? Where are the others? They're not all dead, are they? Shut up! Don't talk to me! Sorry. Everyone, I hope you're all right. Oh, man. Welcome, little lamb. I see you've survived. Oh, you're doing amazingly. The next trial will be the last one on this floor. There's so much shit already. Nothing is gonna scare me off now. This is the 14th question. Would you date someone who was already married? <laughs> I see. So that's it. I'm done asking questions. Now, well, you're almost there. I'll say goodbye to you here. Only a very small number of sheep have ever reached the cathedral. In this century, you're the first. Ugh. I hear there are more holy stairs with red carpet at the top of the cathedral. Get there, but don't let go of what's important to you. If you can, then you'll be free. It's important to me. I don't know. But I'll worry about tomorrow, tomorrow. In any case, I'm getting the hell out of here. Now hurry up and take me up there. Well... I'll lead you to the next trial. Wait for me, Catherine. This is the final area for tonight. The glowing black hole blocks suck in anything placed on top of them. Avoid stepping on them. Once you pass this area, you'll reach your final destination, the cathedral. Vincent Brooks. How you feel? Who's there?
got it. Sin won't just disappear. Oh.
you are. I, I don't want to die. Where... Where's Catherine? Catherine? Wait a second. Voice. You're... You're Steve, aren't you? Huh? How do you know my name? Oh, uh, well... I'm Steve Doe Home. I'm a dentist. I see. That voice. You're Vincent, aren't you? What a twist of fate. It looks like I'm cursed. You figured something out? I've been cursed by Catherine. How do you get a curse from that? Don't you get it? You're cursed too. It's revenge for betrayal. Revenge? And the Catherine you're talking about is... Spiral Corridor. Just keep coming. Mm -hmm. I had a dream where I felt dead and struggled and struggled like I was being chased by something crazy. Mm -hmm. Yo, you listening? Hey, Orlando. Man, we've had these crazy dreams every night. So how come we can't remember them clearly? Huh? Now that you mention it, I just. I can't shake this feeling. I, I can't remember. The series of mysterious male deaths continues with another gruesome discovery this morning. Local dentist Steve Delhomme, age 42, was found dead at his home. His wife, who he'd been feuding with, found him dead in his sleep this morning. Like the other victims, his body was in an atypically weakened state, inconsistent with known causes of sudden death. Can't be. Huh? Hey, uh, you all right, man? Whoa, that dead guy on the news just now, I know that guy. He lived in my neighborhood. The police came this morning. Oh, God, it was so loud. That sounds like a bad way to start the morning. That bastard was cheating on his wife with a younger woman. The entire neighborhood knew because he bragged about it to everyone. What a creep. You gotta feel bad for the kids in that situation. Oh, they didn't have any kids. But still, what a horrible man. Hey, what is it? We met last night. In my dream. Huh? Met who? I remember now. It was him. He died in my dream. Him? The guy in the news? <laughs> That's crazy talk, man. What did he say? Wait, that's right. It's, it's starting to come back to me now. He said it was a curse. Because he betrayed someone. Hey, cut that out. You're trying to tell me he was killed in his dreams or something? You are fucking crazy. Well, maybe not. Think about it. The rumor? Maybe it's true. 
The dreams we've been having every night. Did you honestly just say that? How does this tie in with betrayal? I'm the one that got betrayed. Yeah. Sorry. Enough bullshit. We just can't think straight because we're too damn tired. We wake up all bleary-eyed and the world's full of rumors. And then we can't sleep because all this crazy shit's stuck in our heads. Y you're probably right. Exactly. I didn't betray anyone. I was the one who was betrayed. So why is... Fuck. I didn't mean to bring that up. I was... I was just thinking. Eh, uh, it's all stupid. Yeah. <sighs> Man. What about you? You dumped the girl you're cheating with? Actually, I was gonna go talk to her after this. <laughs> It'll be a horrible date, but I've made up my mind. I'm ending it. I see. When this is all done, I'm gonna propose to her. To the one I know I love. Of course, I haven't bought a ring yet. <laughs> the ring can come anytime. Good luck. <laughs> yeah. Vincent over there. You just leave him alone. Don't get messed up and all that. Oh, hey, there's something I wanted to tell you. Check this out. Yesterday, I finally became a man. Got rid of my V card. Boom. Uh, wait, back up. With who? Take a wild guess. It shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> uh, Erica. Yep, bingo. Sorry, I got to her first, man. <sighs> Seriously? Yeah, but there was something weird about it. You know, I can't really explain it. It's probably just because it was my first time. Maybe, you know, just my imagination, but... So what happened to Johnny? You coming by yourself? <laughs> yeah, he's not coming today. He, uh, went pretty bad earlier. <sighs> I see. Kind of weird everyone's tired all the time, huh? Vincent's infected us, damn it. Uh, so you see, I mean, there's nothing wrong with you. <sighs> so then, there's someone else, isn't there? I've been meaning to tell you all this time, but I couldn't. I had a lot of things on my mind, and then you came along. I guess I was trying to escape reality. Do you like her more than me? Look, I'm sorry. She's someone I really need to hold dear, so... Hold dear? Wait, so does that mean you're already dating her? I'm sorry. <laughs> well... I don't mind. <laughs> you don't mind? As long as I'm your number one, you can have fun with her. We can just go on like we've been doing. <laughs> well, you might not mind, but I do. Why? You want to know why. To be totally honest, she's pregnant with my child. <gasps> so, I've decided to marry her. Y you're joking, right? I I'm fine with that. I just want to be your girl. So... <sighs> no way. I, I, I couldn't live like that. I can't see you anymore. You can't see me. But... no. <sighs> Please don't. <laughs> Who wouldn't cry in a situation like this? This is all my fault. I'm sorry. I'm really, really sorry. But there's only room in my heart for Catherine. It was a mistake, all right? <laughs> mistake? I'm not good looking. I, I don't have any money. So no matter how you spend it, I'm no good for you. You're still young, so you probably just went with the flow. So... It wasn't like that! Look, I know I'm being a real jerk, but we need to end this. I'll do anything else you ask of me. <laughs> anything else? What else is there? 
I'm going to die. Please don't say stuff like that. Just... Catherine, wait! Hey, Catherine, you okay? Do I look like I'm okay? Take it back. I... I can't do that. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I'll do anything. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> Really pissing me off. You don't get it. I could do anything you want me to. I'm protecting you. Why are you trying to leave me? Are you an idiot? Yeah, I'm an idiot. Shit. My spleen. Don't you see you're making a huge mistake? You really, really should not leave me! Even still, I... Stop! No, no, no weapons! Dude, what's up with that? That was Vincent's voice, right? Oh man, I hope he's okay. But that just means I want to be even less involved. Chief? You all right there, buddy? <sighs> We're uh, heading home now. What's the story? You staying here? I don't want to move. Oh, hi, Erica. Vincent, why don't you go home? You look terrible. I deserve it. <laughs> huh? I lied to her. I hurt her, too. <sighs> You're just gonna have to swear never to do this again. It's not the right thing to do, but just pretend this was a bad dream. You don't have to try and cheer me up. I need to apologize to Catherine someday. This isn't something I can keep quiet about. Look, just don't stress yourself. Just go home early today and get some sleep, okay? Yeah. I'll go after a couple of drinks. Tonight, I think I might actually be able to get some sleep. Toby. Uh, huh? Uh, yeah, coming. <laughs>